Hi guys, I feel like I haven't filmed a video sitting in this spot in what feels like forever. I think it's definitely been several weeks. I just don't feel enthusiastic enough to like film in this spot anymore and I've always been one to stick by like don't just do like what's with the trend or like what you know gets views like do stuff that makes you happy so that's been a lot of like why my content's been like all over the place because I literally don't really have like an algorithm or anything that I go with I just film what I want to but if you guys are only here for like music related stuff and merch stuff there's definitely gonna be some merch in this I'm gonna be filming another merch haul very soon also a vinyl record collection updates gonna be coming and I'm gonna be filming the entire week that we're in Columbus for the takeover tour so stay tuned for that but today's video is gonna be a hot topic haul I spent my hot cash and this is the stuff that I managed to pick up. Definitely held back. There was a lot of stuff that I wanted, but I was just like, I don't need it. So I didn't order it. Like they had this really cute Coraline lounge fly purse, but I didn't buy it because I just, I knew I wasn't going to probably use it. So I didn't need it. So I just ordered a few little things. First off here, we have a... Pocket Pop! We have Sally Sewing. Super excited about this. This was the last one from this set that I needed for my Pocket Pop collection. So I picked her up. I did get the other three uh, during one of my shifts at GameStop. So I did manage to get the other three in the collection. So I do already have them. I just haven't put them up on my cork board yet. And I probably won't for a minute because my husband spiderwebbed my entire office for Halloween. So my cork board is like currently covered in cobwebs. Brandon did this while I was sleeping. And I don't know how to feel because there's so many spiderwebs everywhere. <laughs> Then I got one single mystery pin because I haven't been buying these a lot either. I just don't really... I love mystery things and like I want to do it for a video, but I just don't need to. So I got this one. This is the Nightmare Before Christmas set, I guess, for this year. It's another tarot card set, but I love all of the pins on this one. I don't think there's a chase. I would love death because it's zero. But I also really want the Fool for Oogie Boogie or the Lovers. I am going to open it now. And for some reason it opened like this. Kind of weird, but... And I think these are pretty much the same size as the other ones. There's already two other tarot card series, so it's kind of repetitive. But it is a different color story, and I believe there's some different pictures, so... Hopefully... We get one that I want. And we got Sally the Queen. Unfortunately, with this one, I do like her, but her picture is a duplicate from the Gold and Black series. So I do already technically have this pin. It's just black and gold, but this is the like monochromatic sort of like faded colored wave one of her. So again, I was okay with getting any of these because I just like the Nightmare Before Christmas. So this was the only mystery pin I got. Kind of funny I got her to go with the Sewing Sally Funko Pop. So I'm definitely not disappointed in that. They go together. And then we have our loan box here. So I'm going to try to... I did get some stuff for my friend. So Jasmine, if you're watching, stop watching. But I got her these My Melody earrings. And they're these really cute lollipops with My Melody on them from Sanrio. I might put it in her boo basket because I'm making her a boo basket. I also got her the choker necklace. That's My Melody. I thought it was cute because it's got little pearls on it. And it just has a rose gold heart with My Melody on it. So I got her this as well because she collects Sanrio, so... You guys know me, you know I love 101 Dalmatians. So this was a new lounge fly item that I don't have. There's still another bag on their website that I don't have, but I'm not like in a rush to buy it, so... I got this little crossbody 
and it's so cute because it has one of the puppies holding a teddy bear on the front and it is lounge fly and then on the back it's Pongo and Purdy and then a bunch of the puppies and I think that it looks super cute. These are only ever $14.90 so they're a pretty good deal and they're really nice canvas material for like going to the zoo or flea markets or thrifting, any of that stuff. will definitely go with a lot of my Dalmatian bags. So it has a bunch of the puppies on the front and then there's spots on the card holders. It also opens in the middle, it is just solid black. And then on the other side, there's just one little puppy. But it'll hold six cards, and then you can put some cash or some change in the middle. So I really like these. I think these are a really nice size. And again, I think they go with a lot of different things. This was also $14.90. And then the last Dalmatian thing that I got was this eyeshadow palette. Now, I'm not a huge fan of the colors in this eyeshadow palette. I did definitely buy this more so for like collectability purposes versus actually using it. But I'm happy that I ordered it because we did go to a store that had them and they all had big box cutter marks on them, so I didn't buy any of them. So the cover of the palette's very similar to the back of the bag. And this is all done by like Hot Topic, so like they make the makeup on the inside and everything. It is cruelty free, which is really nice, and it does have like the rights to Disney. This is the palette, and then when you open it, it has spots around the mirror. But this is the palette. It's very neutral and pretty bland in my opinion. It would have been nice if they did some pops of color, like put some red or some blues in there because of the dog's collars. But yeah, I did just get this to put in my china cabinet though. I'm not actually going to be using it because I don't really like their makeup to begin with. I don't think it's that good of a quality. So last thing I got, which I'm obsessed with, is this scaled and icy little like banner I don't know what it's called oh a pennant it's a scaled and icy pennant and it's like really nice I mean it's the regular like felt material but it's pretty long like this is bigger than I was expecting it to be and I really like this I'm definitely gonna probably put this on my wall somewhere. I'm sure I have a spot where I can hang this up, but yeah, this was $12.90. I love what I was able to find and I'm very happy with it. So yeah, I'm really excited about this pennant. I think this is really cool. I wish I could incorporate this into the concert somehow, but I don't know how I would do that because if I actually put it like on a stick and held it up, I feel like people would get mad at me. So that's everything that I got. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again very, very soon. Peace out, Girl Scouts.